We are come to online classes. This is class 5 primary science. Dear children, now you open on page 7. Today we are going to discuss seed dispersal and its agents. Okay? Seed dispersal means scattered. Okay? Who scattered its agent? Okay, agent is there to take the, the seed from one place to another place and there it germinate a new plant. Okay, now let us read. Seeds are scattered to different places away from the parents plants by some process. Okay, some process are there. The seeds are scattered different places, okay, away from their parents' plants, okay, parents from parents' plants, these seeds are scattered here and there. This process called what? Seed dispersal. So, now we, we know that what is seed dispersal? Seed dispersal means from the parents plants okay seeds are scattered here and there okay this is this process is called seed dispersal okay the process of dispersal is carried out by agents like wind water animals and explosion so this dispersal is carried out okay some agents are there who are this wind water animals and explosion so now come dispersal by wind by wind how this seed scattered here and there now let us read seeds of some plants are lightweight Okay. some plants are light so so weight or not weight this is light so not heavy so it can be carried out from one place to another place by wind okay and are hairy and winds okay hairy and winds these seeds can be easily carried away by wind Okay, these seeds okay so examples are let us see dandelion cotton and madon madon okay these seeds are carried out by winds let us see here pictures is given dispersal by wind this wind you see wind is blowing okay from these plants parents plants the seeds are carried out by different places okay now let us come dispersal by water water how the carried out okay this water how the takes or scattered from one place to another place the seeds okay now some plants have spongy okay some plants are spongy sponge okay so light seeds or seeds with fibrous outer coverings which helps help these seeds stay afloat a float in water so in water it float okay it float the you see the example here so in water the coconut is floating okay so like that some seeds are float okay it floating from one place to another place okay water carries these seeds to large distance okay examples of such plants are lotus one of the lotus we have seen lotus flowers or we have seen the lotus plant okay how this lotus uh, it uh, comes out from water and it carries out from one place to another place so by the water only it carries out 
from one place to another place spongy seed so this is spongy seed is a lotus and coconut fibrous outer covering on the seed okay this is the coconut or this lotus or so spongy type so these are carried out by water okay water here water is the uh, agents okay dispersal by animals animals usually eat fruits and uh, throw away seeds okay these animals they eat and uh, they throw where they eat there only they leave the seeds okay okay then some fruits are eaten by eaten up by birds and animals along with seeds okay some fruits are eaten by birds and animals these seeds are then excreted in the droppings okay or faces of these animals and birds so some seeds they eat and they throw here and there from there the seeds comes out a new plant okay then some seeds have hooks okay some seeds have they have hooks and uh, or spines or hair which cling to the bodies of animals and these seeds then get carried away from their parent plants <coughs> okay some seeds they have hook suppose a animal is going they can stick the animal and uh, they can go from with animal okay they can hook hook means they can suppose here birds so eating or here it can taking by this birds how the fruit this taking okay from mouth it is taking and some fruit or a seed it can be hook by the birds or animals and uh, from one place to another place it may go okay then get carried away from their parent plants okay examples you let us see examples are janthium okay hooks and spear grass okay this is at the example okay this uh, car is from one place to another place by hook okay dispersal by fruit exploration okay how the this uh, fruit exploration has working let us read poppy pea violet and uh, bean fruits burst open on ripening the seeds get scattered in all direction so some fruits or beans or pea poppy or violet this are when they ripen okay then after ripening they burst okay after when it is bursting the seeds are scattered here and there from there the new plants germinate okay need for seed dispersal so we know that plants are fixed we know plants are fixed one place at one place and cannot move from place to place to dispersal their seeds okay plants are fixed in pla one place but it uh, doesn't go from one place to another place if so, so many seeds grow too close to one another then none of them will get sufficient water space and sunlight so suppose some trees it is uh, it has germinated in one places okay so one place it is germinated but uh, when it gives fruits and uh, when this uh, seeds are again scattered nearby so again it comes a new plants so this new plants they do not get sufficient water and do not get space to come out and sunlight that is the reason it 
dies okay the seeds dies or it doesn't grow as a result healthy plants will not grow okay healthy plants are because of this the healthy plants doesn't grow thus it is important that seeds are dispersed dispersed away from the parents plants this is the important that seeds are dispersed okay away from the parents plants that is why this parents plant to it has to be dispersed or it has to scattered from one place to another place okay so for you this is uh, homework this you work uh, corner you see so write two examples for each so 1 2 3 4 just you write down here examples okay so it is written the question so please write down so this is for your homework so thank you for watching this video